The overall goal of this process is to demonstrate the production of hydrocarbon fuels from lignocellulosic biomass in a two-step process consisting of fast pyrolysis and hydrotreating. This method can help answer key questions in the biofuels field, such as the impact of feedstock and operating conditions on the quality and yield of pyrolysis bio-oil and the hydrocarbon product. The main advantage of this technique is that it allows for production of oil in industrially relevant reactors and in sufficient quantities to evaluate the fully integrated process. The general problems with pyrolysis operations are feeding biomass reliably, keeping condensed vapors from plugging heated transfer lines on the condenser inlet, and achieving complete condensation. Catalyst bed plugging during hydro treating due to the instability of pyrolysis by oil is adjusted by using a two-stage process including a stabilization stage. Demonstrating the pyrolysis procedure will be Kelleen Orton from the National Renewable Energy Laboratory. The pyrolysis reactor used is a laboratory-built 5.0 cm inner diameter bubbling fluidized bed reactor equipped with a glass condensation system. Assemble the pyrolysis reactor, cyclone with char receiver, and hot filter as described in the text protocol. For the first condenser, use a graphite ferrule in a compression union to couple the stainless steel tubing to a piece of borosilicate glass tubing fused to a standard taper joint. Avoid over-tightening. Apply silicone grease or a Teflon sleeve to the standard taper joint. Connect the first condenser to a...